Hey, you. Yes, you. You that is sleeping with a married man and dating a married man. Yes, you. You that is in love with a married man, other man's husband. Do you know that a lot of married men are having an affair with you so that they will not divorce their wives? <laughs> sure, I told you that this message is for you. You. Hmm. That married man you are dating is actually dating you so that he can keep his marriage. You are giving him everything that he lacks in the marriage. Why do you think he's going to leave his wife? No, no, no. Reason it now. Just use one minute. You are the distraction. I have said it a lot of time. It is side chicks. That is the reason why a lot of women are still married. A lot of marriages are still standing strong because of side chicks. Because everything their husbands are lacking, they are getting it for free from young girls who they are giving peanuts. That's the reason why it is hard for that married man to marry you. I will leave my wife, I will leave my wife. They will never leave their wives. Because everything they are lacking in the marriage, you are giving them. You are the one holding the marriage. You don't know. A lot of you side chicks are very powerful. Now you hold the marriage. Because everything his wife cannot do, you are doing it. When the wife is pregnant, you are servicing him. When the wife is not in the mood, you are servicing him. Everything his wife cannot do for him, you are doing for him. That's the reason why he would rather keep you as a baby mama. So that you can be satisfying his need. Let me tell you something you don't understand. A lot of married men are selfish and they are very transactional. That's the reason why when a married man wants to chase you, he will spoil you with gifts. It's transactional for him. He wants something from you. Stop getting carried away when you're dating a married man. It's strictly business. If you decide to choose to date a married man, it is business. You know, I find it so annoying when I see a lot of beautiful young ladies saying, I'm in love with a married man, somebody else's husband. If you want a married man to marry you, don't sleep with him. If you want a married man to, give, to leave his wife, deprive him. Yes! You cannot be giving somebody everything that you tell them to come and marry you for. It is the relationship that that married man is having with you that is solidifying his marriage. That is making the marriage strong. Kakaraka. Oh, you think because you are sleeping with a married man, you want to scatter the marriage. And that's why a lot of married men are always angry when they see their wives going to fight side chick. Why are you going to fight it? Fight the woman that is building your home. A lot of married men are always very angry when their wife goes to fight side chick that is not the side chick that is helping them. Because if a lot of these side chicks decide to close their leg, your marriage will scatter. Husband will leave you. So this message is for young girls who are dating married men. I want to advise you like a big sister and a big auntie. So listen, I hope we draw your ear. Hmm? This message is from a sister to a sister. Women supporting women. <clears throat> See, when you are dating a married man, build them. What did I say? Build them. It is transactional. Nothing like I'm in love with him. I'm in love with him. If you decide to want to carry belly, Let's see that the pregnancy you are carrying is because you want to benefit something. Because I know a lot of young girls are getting pregnant for married men because they want to be collecting money from him. Good. At least you know what you are doing. But I'm talking to you that used to go and fall in love with somebody's husband. That means I'm in love. I'm in love. You're in love with somebody's husband. He will not leave his wife for you. And even if he leaves his wife for you, he will not marry you. He cannot even leave his wife for you. A lot of times, you are not the one causing problem in that married man's home. Stop feeling too important. Many times, a lot of these married men already have problems in their homes before they came to meet you. You are just a distraction. Stop feeling like, oh, it is because he's dating me. That's why his marriage is scattering. It's a lie. His marriage has been scattering before he met you. You are the one even arranging it with the good and the good company that you are giving him. A lot of these married men's marriage are scattered. Forget all these married women that are looking for who to push blame on. Their marriage has scattered before you even came in. A lot of these marriages are not working. These men are looking for distractions. Don't let them to use you. A lot of these married women are just looking for who to push blame on. Some of them, it's not you that is causing the problem. Some of them, they cannot communicate. Some of them are married to strangers. Some of them do not even, they have their issues. They just want to come and put you in the middle. So as a young girl and you decide to date a married man, it should be transactional. Don't go and fall in love with people's husband. Go and find your own. They will not leave their wives for you. And even if they leave their wives, they will not still marry you. I know of a lot of married men that have left their wife. They did not still marry you. They will still come and tell you, so it simply means it's not about you. Hmm? If a married man truly loves you, he will not be with his wife. 
It's nothing like I'm going to leave her. I'm going to leave her. He will not leave his wife. You're already playing the role. So be transactional. Let it be something that you are benefiting. Not love. You can't love somebody's husband. If God wants to send somebody's husband to you, his wife will go before you come in. If God wants to send somebody's husband to you, they will be divorced before you. Just like me. I left my ex-husband before another woman came in. If I was there, she cannot come inside. So her prayer was answered. He has to be single for her to go in. So a married man cannot be married and he be saying that he should live. If he wants to leave his wife, you will not even be in the picture. He will leave his wife before he come and meets you. So stop allowing these married men deceive you and use you. Because my anger is that they are using most of these young girls and they are deceiving you. Don't worry, don't worry. And they'll be they're making sometimes they're making you they're making you do dirty things in the name of I love you. They'll be using you to do experiment and adventure. By what rubbish? They will debase you. You see, I'm doing experiment, adventure.